This is Alex with Shiny Shiny and Tech Digest, and I have with me the Medio speakers. Um, this is the UFO version, and I think you can work out why. Now, these speakers are very special. As you'll see, I've got a, a BlackBerry in one hand and wires trailing out the top. I'm going to put this down very carefully. But the way these work is by emitting very little sound themselves, and then they use um, technology that uses sound waves through the plate here that vibrate through whatever surface you put it on, thus expanding the sound. So you'll get all the amplification from the sound waves vibrating whatever surface you put it on. Now it's supposed to work on glass, plastic, wood and various other surfaces. So as you can see we set up this terribly technical laboratory over here and we're going to try it on a few different things that we found lying around the office basically to see how well it works and what you can get the best sound quality out of. Now in the top you'll see it connects to MP3 player, which is using a BlackBerry that has a media player, and the other side goes to either a plug into the wall or if you want to take it on the road with you eight AA batteries in a battery pack that you can take with you wherever you like. So we're going to start out with um, the floor in fact because that's wood so one would think we'd get quite a good uh, effect out of that. So you see to turn it on at the front and then start the music hopefully and there we go. If I pick it off, you'll see that's what you actually get out of the speaker until you put it down on some sort of surface. And then... Let's pause for a second and move it to plastic. See if this is any better. I wonder if that's because this is wood on the floor. It'd probably work better if it's on some sort of surface off the floor. So we're going to try um, an upside down snowboard, which we think is fiberglass and various other bits and pieces. So let's see if that works any better. It sounded slightly tinny to me, but actually, obviously, taking something off the floor and having the space underneath it definitely works a lot better. Finally, glass, and this has the advantage of having this as a little bubble of air underneath. Let's see if that helps. Ooh. Oh, not so good. Not so good at all. So I would say either perhaps a thin wood surface like a chair off the floor, or the plastic probably had the best results. Now, these you will find at uh, Twisted Carbon for about £70. There's also a... <laughs> It's a little round dome shaped one with little pig ears and nose at the front which is unsurprisingly called the piggy uh, and that one's available for about £50 and there's also a, a sort of cylindrical keg version which is I think £80. Uh, the keg is silver and black, this is red, uh, black and possibly silver as well and the piggy is white with either green, blue or pink um, accents where the nose is. So there's lots of different varieties. Um, quite a clever idea because it means that you don't have to haul around big speakers with you, you just need an appropriate surface to put it on. And they are fun to play with.